A new study by the Southern Poverty Law Center shows hate groups in America are on the rise. Reporter Steve Doty joins us in the Cronkite News Online Bureau with the details and no new numbers. Steve? That's right, Sierra. For the first time, the number of active hate groups in the United States has gone over 1,000, and the number in Arizona has risen as well. When you think of hate groups in Arizona, one of the first that comes to mind is those against illegal immigration, since it's such a big problem here in Arizona. These hate groups have been very successfully exploiting the issue of illegal immigration. According to the Southern Poverty Law Center, there are now 22 active hate groups in Arizona and 1,000 across the country. This is the first time ever that these active hate groups have surpassed the 1,000 mark. But not all the groups on the list consider themselves hate groups. In fact, it's upsetting to some who made the list. It frustrates me because we, we don't hate. According to the list, the Jewish Defense League is listed as a general hate group, but Michael Tuber says his organization is not a hate group. They will just stand up for the Jewish community when certain things happen to them. Death threats, um, bomb threats, um, or if something has happened, we will definitely retaliate. But it's that talk of retaliation that landed them on the hate list. Well, because they are or have been over the years a terrorist organization. The Jewish Defense League's last leader uh, died in prison after being convicted for attempting to blow up a mosque in Culver City, California. So whether some of these groups like it or not, they are targeted as one of the 22 hate groups in Arizona. The Southern Poverty Law Center attributes its growth in hate groups to numerous factors, including resentment over a rapidly changing demographic in the country and frustration over a lagging economy. Live in the online news bureau, Steve Doty, Cronkite News.